You told me before that you wanted to travel the world and you wanted to paint. That was my dream. Hello people, I'm here at the biggest ashram of Europe and next to me is Nassimo Kardami Kapilar Das. That's his spiritual name? Yes, that's my spiritual name. Yeah, and he is a street art and fine art artist. And we're standing here in front of his art. It's one of the paintings you did here at this ashram. Yeah, that uh, painting I did uh, w uh, last year, 2017. And uh, you can see now the new one. And the new one is really special. Can you tell me why? Uh, you know, everything is special in this world, uh, maybe because it's new, first of all, and second because uh, it's, um, it's showing something uh, very sacred that uh, everyone is looking for, and uh, we're all looking for love and sharing and um, um, supporting, and um, I decided to make uh, here on this wall uh, the best example from the spiritual world that is revealed in a... Um, old scriptures about the Lord and his beloved and they are the best example about uh, what is the perfect love perfect loving uh, relationship wow so beautiful how big is this picture I don't know exactly in meters but uh, I know that it's six floors six floors uh, yeah that's so nice let's have a look there <laughs> Who is this on the on the picture? The blue guy. The Who's blue, that? <laughs> the blue guy. Yoga people know uh, in the revealed scriptures. It's uh, it's described that the Lord have uh, that kind of bluish um, appearance features. So this is the the supreme Lord who is enjoying uh, together with his beloved uh, Shirmati Radharani. Mm -hmm. That's so beautiful. And this is the uh, biggest um, ever painting of him, isn't it? I never saw such big painting of Radha and Krishna in my life. So I don't know. For, I think that is the biggest one. Yeah. Yeah, I love it. It's really, wow, fascinating. All the details and how did you make it on this big wall? I used to do uh, that kind of uh, murals and uh, paintings on the wall from 25, 23 years. So somehow, you know, I developed the skills to uh, organize myself and to understand how to um, make it uh, in a proper way. Mm -hmm. So you have a lot of experience with this uh, street art that you make. Uh, not only with street art, I uh, finish. Um, I graduate in a fine art academy, and um, I do a lot of uh, paintings with uh, oil colors. Um, it's so it's mixture between uh, street art and fine art, and uh, yeah, I and I paint from a very young age. So you know, it's uh, depending of practice, of uh, skills, and um, but it's and the ability that uh, the Lord is given to us. Mm. In what age, uh, age do you have, uh, have you started this whole experience with the art? Mm, I think uh, when I was two or three years old, I was starting to paint. Wow, that's <laughs> very early. So uh, it starts uh, very young and then you just did it the whole time till yes. now? Yes, I never did uh, anything else. I love this and uh, I like this. And uh, I don't think that I want to make something else in my life. So beautiful. So you told me before that you wanted to travel the world and you wanted to paint. That was my dream uh, when I was uh, like uh, 19 years old maybe. I don't know. I don't remember. But uh, uh, when I when I turned uh, the time back and I can see that this, uh, this dream is uh, already fulfilled for many years. And I uh, continue to travel over the world, painting everywhere and uh, it's wonderful to meet uh, different new people, friends. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so cool. So you, normally you live in your car, you travel and you paint. Oh, in my car, in the plane. <laughs> <laughs> in, uh, you know, all the time I'm on the road, but uh, it's not so bad. 
not yeah. so bad. Some people will really dream about this, and I have this opportunity. Uh, it's like that. Yeah, and you inspire so people with these beautiful pictures. I think I think um, we have to uh, be brave enough and to make the first step and to start living our dreams mm. and to start uh, doing uh, the things that we really like and love and uh, then everything it uh, it will become um, by itself <laughs> If you are brave enough and to make the first step, then uh, the second one is so easy. Just the first is so uh, difficult. That, that's what I believe. Then it comes with the flow. Yes. That's so nice, cool. So your plans for the future are doing this forever. Uh, yes, do I, do I have this possibility? I want to do it. Yeah. yeah so we'll see, you know, you never know. Beautiful, I see the shining in your eyes. <laughs> That's perfect. Uh, maybe this is a reflection uh, from your eyes. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> reflection, reflection. <laughs> yeah, beautiful. Thank you for this interview. Thank you too.